every single college student needs this what is up boyfriends girlfriends and everybody in between my name is lexi if you haven't seen my face before go ahead and hit that subscribe button if you haven't already and the nice comment shout out of the video goes to this person right here thank you so so much for all of your kind words they truly truly mean the world and if you want to be my next nice comment shout out in my next video just leave a nice comment down below welcome to the video guys as always i hope that everybody is doing well and in this video i have my first i guess you could say annual college apartment haul but every single thing in this haul is also dorm friendly so if you're moving into a dorm room or an apartment this video is definitely for you i have so much stuff so it was most ideal for me to split this video up into different categories so this is part one of maybe three videos so be sure to subscribe to my channel and turn on my post notifications so you guys can see the rest of this little apartment haul slash dorm friendly series that i have going on because of the pandemic i was on campus for my freshman year up until that march that everything sort of got shut down i did remote learning for the rest of my freshman year as well as my entire sophomore year and this is my first time that i am expecting to go back on campus since the pandemic hit which i am super excited about the only thing that's different since the last time i was actually physically on campus is i will be moving into my first ever apartment which i'm also super excited about i am studying cognitive science and journalism as a double major i think that covers all grounds for background information and questions that new viewers might be asking me i will be covering bedroom stuff as well as bedroom decor and bathroom stuff in this video i'm gonna stop rambling and let's get into this very exciting apartment and dorm friendly haul you guys will be able to pick up pretty quick if you guys are new to my channel for returning subscribers slash viewers i will still be going with the bohemian sort of colorful theme that i had going on in my freshman dorm one because i really liked it and i have not grown out of it i don't think i ever will and also because i already have a bunch of my stuff still in storage in pennsylvania which is where my college is and i was like might as well use it and just add a few more things to the decor and theme that i already had going on so i'm gonna start with some big stuff first just to get that out of the way i don't know if i would call it a memo board but it has these like clips on it for you to clip on like things like maybe some prints off of etsy pictures honestly anything that you can think of but it is super super cute and it's sort of like this like line abstract art and it is pretty big but it's also very very lightweight and super airy it's gold i love gold accents i love gold jewelry and i absolutely cannot wait to put this on my wall in my bedroom in my brand new apartment i did get that piece from ikea it was around 14 15 dollars so a pretty reasonable price and once again very lightweight super super pretty and if you're somebody who likes a more airy and minimalistic living space i think it's a great functional piece as well as some decor for you as well i am super excited to put some stuff on there like i was saying earlier prints pictures of me and my friends perhaps maybe some affirmations just to make my bedroom specifically feel like my personal space you guys who have been watching me for a while know this but i am super super passionate about decorating my living spaces and making them feel super comfortable and maybe that's not a priority for some people but for me it is super important that i have a comfortable space to get work done and also ground myself and by shopping at places like tj maxx home goods marshalls as well as ikea and just stores like that you can do so for a very affordable price speaking of affordable i do have an additional piece of wall decor that i am super excited about you guys can see like my background here but it is this macrame mirror and i have plans to hang this above my bed and also to just open up the space above my bed this is so beautiful you guys i got it from home goods for 24.99 and when i tell you guys i am so obsessed with this i am i have no idea how i'm gonna get it to pennsylvania i might even take it as a carry-on on the plane when i'm flying up but you guys this is so beautiful and again reinforcing that sort of bohemian very comfortable and earthy and eclectic vibe that i'm going for in my room this is also pretty lightweight so you could totally hang this up with a command strip or a small nail if you're permitted to do that in your living space oh my gosh i think that's gonna be so beautiful above my bed just to open the space up and also add some texture which here in a second you guys are going to hear me say texture a thousand times because i absolutely love textures i think it makes your living space feel super comfy super cozy and also gives it a little more personality as well for the next 
big thing. <laughs> this stuff is just so hard to show on camera, which is why I wanted to show this to you guys first. I have this wall shelf here. This is called the Lac Wall Shelf, and this also is from Ikea. This was about $19.99, I believe. I will have absolutely everything that I can possibly find from this haul, and also similar items if I can't find exact. Link down below in the description box for you guys to shop, so check that out if you guys are interested in any of these pieces. Also, last minute purchases for maybe some decor, bedroom stuff, and also bathroom stuff. I'm sure it will be able to ship to you before you move in or maybe a little after. Initially, I wanted to just get the picture ledges, which I also did purchase some white picture ledges from Ikea, but I have decided that I'm gonna go with this because this can be repurposed as even a desk if you bolt it a little lower on your wall and just put a chair in front of it. But I will be using this as a shelf on the long side of my bed. So I'm gonna have the mirror where a headboard would go and then I'm going to have this as a wall shelf and I'm going to use it as a picture ledge. I might have a couple of plants dangling down on it and also some books perhaps but this is going to be basically the center of my wall decor in my bedroom and i'm super super excited to play around with it i'm gonna buy some prints from probably etsy or something like that or if you're an artist and you have prints that you sell please feel free to contact me using the business email in my description box i would love to display your artwork in my room so let me know you artists out there if you guys have any prints that you guys would think i would like a huge priority for me when i'm shopping for big things that i am going to be spending a good bit of money on maybe not super expensive things but just bigger things is i want to make sure that i can use it for a long time and also use it for multiple different things in multiple different spaces and that is exactly what this gives me you guys will see on the ikea website if you guys click the link for this how many different ways people have been using this and i'm sure also if you go on pinterest you can get some more inspiration for how people have been using this exact piece in a lot of creative ways and this is something that i know that i'll have for a long time i opted for white just because i do like brighter new neutral colors this really pretty neutral pillow i know i was talking a little bit about textures and how much i love them you guys cannot go wrong with textures especially if you're going for a more eclectic and bohemian and earthy vibe this one i found at home goods and it was only $24.99 it is by the brand magashoni home and i have a bunch of their pillows in my bedroom at home which is where i am right now in my bedroom upstairs and they have never disappointed me ever super great quality pillows really really soft as well just a nice neutral pillow and i also have another really big throw pillow that's going to pair really well with this one that i'm going to show you guys right now all right next up i have this big gigantic throw pillow i feel like this is a great dupe for those sort of anthropology type pillows i love anthropology but their pillows can really get up there in price i did find this one at a home goods for 29.99 which is a really really great price for a pillow like this this is like anthropology worthy like i would not be surprised if i saw this exact pillow in anthropology for like 200 bucks and i snagged it for 29.99 at home goods i have a basket and inside of this basket i have one more thing to show you guys and it is just this throw blanket from ikea this was super affordable i know it was under 20 dollars. i can't remember the exact price of it but it's just this off-white or cream throw that i'm just going to either throw on the corner of my couch throw in a basket or across my bed super lightweight and can go with almost anybody's decor so i just picked this up because i know i'm gonna get some good use out of it next up i do have this basket here which i have fallen in love with this is from a tj maxx and home goods combo store and i got it for 24.99 they did have a bigger size but because i am going to be living in not necessarily a small apartment but because i want to use it in my bedroom which is obviously a smaller space i didn't want it to take up too much floor space so i did offer the smaller one and also if i'm being completely honest i just thought this one was a lot cuter as well and you guys i am obsessed once again 24.99 and it is by the brand c and c california home and you can just see the craftsmanship of this basket it looks like so much love went into making this and once again the sort of textures different dimensions different patterns i just love 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 and it's just a basket to throw some extra throw pillows in for a pop of color some extra throw blankets in if you don't need them on your bed or you don't want them out just for friends to grab if you're watching movies and having a movie night something that's super functional as well as super cute and is going to really make my decor come together okay we cleared off that side and now we're going on to the next so the first couple of things that i have here are a little fragile so i want to go ahead and get these out of the way first my mom actually got these for me for my birthday this summer and they are by opal house so they're from target i am pretty sure they still sell those there i had been wanting these little planters for the longest time and they were the cutest things ever basically they are just these little faces with these pretty pink polka dots on the bottom of them they have 
have a bunch of different skin colors and just colors in general but i love pink so my mom got me the pink ones and i definitely want to put these on my windowsill with some really pretty plants that are super easy to take care of because i don't necessarily have the greenest thumb if i'm being completely honest but i am super excited to just add a little bit of life in my bedroom with these planters to have some really cute once again easy to take care of plant i will of course have these in everything that i can find once again link down below for you guys i have just bathroom and bedroom stuff at this point we're not going to go in any particular order of dividing this bathroom and bedroom stuff up because it's all sort of mixed up in this tub but first thing for bathroom is this really great shelf from ikea i'll have this link down below so you guys can see it all put together i actually have one of these in my bathroom upstairs right now and i am just going to slide this in the corner of my bathroom just to put like shower gel hair products just things that i don't don't want taking up counter space on in my bathroom so super excited about this i have this white color pretty sure they also had it in black and maybe another color don't quote me on that definitely check the website out if you are interested they also have a really really slim one of these that i'm more than sure is small enough for you to slide in between a wall and maybe a washer dryer situation but love this so much and i honestly think that the roommate that i'm going to be sharing a bathroom with is going to love this as well next thing that i have here is a duvet filler or a comforter from ikea and i cannot pronounce that for the life of me so i'm not even going to try this is in full queen but i love duvet as you guys know and I actually have a white duvet cover coming in from a brand that I'm super excited to be working with so stick around so you guys can see the white duvet I'm not sure when it's coming in I know it was on back order but they said they would send it to me as soon as it's back in stock and of course I'm going to use this duvet filler to fill that duvet I also already have this in my bedroom upstairs so I definitely shop for things that I know that I already like and this is just an old reliable for me now that we're on the subject I am a really really hot sleeper so I don't necessarily sleep with a duvet unless it's a really cold winter night and I like to layer bedding so I do have a comforter and I will pop it up here on the screen and it's from Target it's by pillow fort and it is in full queen once again and it is pillow fort seersucker comforter set so I am going to use the comforter as sort of the base of my bedding and then put the duvet on top for some extra plushness luxuriousness and it's also white so to also brighten my bed as well I also get really weird about bedding like I need my bed to be clean so in the event that I have friends coming over I always like to have a duvet that I don't sleep with on top so then I know that my comforter that I actually sleep with is clean underneath it the next thing is another Ikea find you guys and when I tell you guys every single college student needs this I'm not too sure if I'm going to use this in my living room or my bedroom I would like to use it in my bedroom but I honestly don't need a floor lamp in my bedroom this lamp is a floor lamp in this little tiny tiny packaging this is a literal floor lamp i couldn't believe it until i saw it and it was only $8.99 it does come with a paper lampshade but you can switch it out for a fabric one if that's your jam i might do that i might not $8.99 for a freaking lamp and it's literally so small and so light this is just great will this last a long time i'm not too sure but if you're sharing a living space with people like i'm going to be i'm going to have three other roommates this is something that's super great because i can understand it. if you're sharing a living space with new people you might not want to go all out and buy a 80 to 100 dollar floor lamp so i feel like this is a great fix i know i already mentioned that i have a ton of stuff in storage so i did buy a lot of these bags from ikea in the event that i want to donate some of my old clothes and old room decor to goodwill whatever the case may be and also to store maybe my winter clothes and then do the switcheroo and store my summer clothes in that does that make sense i hope so but love these so much these clothing bags from ikea well i don't think they're just clothing bags but these storage bags from ikea are super super durable this is only a fraction of the amount that i bought the other ones are all the way over there but you guys get the gist super great for if you're sorting your clothes and also you need to store your clothes that aren't in season right now all right more stuff here so i have this makeup storage ordeal and it was only five dollars from target i'm probably going to use it on my bathroom counter to just organize my skincare product because it doesn't take up a ton of space but you guys i'm absolutely obsessed with this it just comes with this divider in the middle and it is sort of this like clear plastic acrylic ordeal i really like acrylic storage because it's like it's not not even there you know it's like your products are just super organized they're just floating super organized and pretty so that's from target dollar section for only five dollars next up i did get a toilet brush super lightweight from ikea i'm pretty sure this was less than a dollar which you cannot go wrong with that but love 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 and i also got this really cute hourglass from ikea i might end up putting this in the living room that's probably annoying for you guys to hear i might end up putting this in the living room but i would like to put it maybe on my wall shelf perhaps if it looks 
looks cute but they also have this in a pink color i just went with the white just because i wasn't too sure if the pink would match the sort of pinks that i have in my decor already but super reasonable price and of course it's from ikea so you know it's good quality okay i have this long pole here and this is actually a curtain rod from ikea it was definitely under 12 dollars i think the only thing was you had to buy the sort of like wall thing separately but it was only a few cents all together i think it was about 6.99 and i just got it in white because why not i did use curtains as a bed skirt last year and i think that i might use those curtains as actual curtains now because i don't really need a bed skirt anymore so really love this super lightweight and i'm just going to slide this down into a box to ship it up there in the next couple of days and here is like the second part of the curtain rod we're almost done i want to be done i have these picture frames that are gold that i am going to put on my wall shelf and use it sort of as the picture ledge thing that i was talking about earlier gold frames because you guys know i love gold and it's also going to match that sort of memo board little clip thing that i showed you guys earlier in this video but it does have matting and looking for perfect frames that i wanted was a pain in the butt but i'm super super happy that i took my time to pick these out ikea has a wide range of frames and at first i was going to get the ribba frames but then i opted for these because they're gold and they're cute but my second choice was the ribba the only reason i didn't get them was because i initially thought that i was going to do the picture ledge thing and the ribba frames were just really really wide and i wanted to sort of stagger them in front of each other and i don't think i could have done that with the picture ledge regardless i'm happy with my decision for the gold frames but if this isn't your cup of tea i would highly recommend the ribba frames and i will also link them down below so i got two of this size and this size is the 12 by 16 and then i got a couple other sizes i got two more of the five by seven frames and i'm sort of going to like stagger them like put one like this put one like that it's gonna be super cute subscribe and turn on my post notifications so you can see my move-in vlog and also my room tour so you guys can see exactly what i'm talking about the next thing that i got is from ikea as well and they are these super cute prints eight prints and these are the prints that i am going to put on the little clip what is that called like the little clip thing you guys know what i'm talking about the gold clip thing that i showed you guys earlier in this video but i am obsessed my mom also talked me into getting this like little shopping bag thing in case i'm like out with friends and they want to run to the store so i can just throw all of my purchases in here i don't know i thought it was a pretty good idea for being on a college campus you never know when your friends are going to want to go to the mall or go to the grocery store and you want to tag along so that's that the last two things are soap i got this dr bronner's eucalyptus pure castile soap a mentor of mine actually advised me to get this because it has like salt in it and it's really good for releasing negative energy i really like the smell of it so i picked it up for good luck and just to remind me of that mentor and then i also got this soap pump for three dollars at the target dollar section because it's a big bottle and i'm gonna put some of this in here so i don't have to carry this big bottle around all the time and that is the haul i hope you guys enjoyed it all right guys that concludes the first part of my apartment haul series that is also called dorm friendly i really hope that you guys enjoyed the video if you did make sure to give it a big thumbs up and comment down below what you think be sure to follow me on instagram so you guys can see me shopping for this kind of stuff behind the scenes and also so you guys can get a preview of me moving into my very first apartment as a college student make sure to subscribe to my channel and turn on post notifications so you guys can be notified when the next parts of this series come out and also so you guys can follow me along on my journey of moving into my very first apartment make sure to shop the links in the description box down below if you are going to buy these products or are interested in them anyway that really helps me out a lot i am gonna go ahead and sign off but before i go i want to remind you guys to spread kindness and always remember that the less you wander the more you wonder i love you guys so so much and i will see you in my next video bye guys the cottage blues, yeah, I wanna